Yo, what is going on guys? It is the SG Recommends today with another MLB The Show 21 video. And today, we're going to be talking about how to get stubs right now in MLB The Show 21. In case you guys did not know here on the channel, I give you guys a lot of money spend methods. Uh, like whether they need stubs, XP, or pretty much in any sports game that I play. I will give you guys no money spent methods for you guys because I know that's you know pretty much what you want. Um, if you guys have any questions on what I talk about in today's video, make sure you leave a comment down below and I'll answer your comment as soon as possible. All right. Uh, at the end of the video, I'll talk about some stuff with the channel. But first, we're gonna get through all the stubs, uh, like, you know, the stub tips I have for you guys, and then we'll get to that. All right. So let's jump into it. The main way you can make stubs right now, all right, and this is something I highly advise you do, is you want to try to get this program done as as fast as possible. The second inning program. You want to grind this out as fast as possible. Tonight, I'm going to finish up the conquest. Um, see where that takes me. I'm not going to buy these uh, three cards right here. Well, I need to buy two more, but not going to do that. Uh, there's just no point in doing that, in my opinion. What you need to do is just grind the game. That's the best tip I can give you. Grind the game. Uh, play showdown, stuff like that, to get your XP. But you need to get this done as soon as possible to get these cards as soon as possible. All right? You need to just buy, uh, where are they? Right here. Whichever one you can get as fast as possible, all right, just take whatever one goes for the most. You need to get these as fast as possible. These are going for about 80k right now. Uh, usually they would not be this cheap. However, there was an XP glitch that a lot of people used on the first day. So a lot of people actually got all 600, uh, 650,000 XP in the first day. All right, so that kind of sucks. That kind of like ruined the program, ruined the value of the program. A lot of people did it, uh, which is unfortunate. Um, but it is what it is. You're still going to want to try to do this as fast as possible because these cards are still a decent price. Usually these would be about 150000 all right? Uh, obviously they're not. They're about 90000 right now. So, you know, it's unfortunate, but it's still 90 k Now, if you guys, you won't get this done right away, but if you can get this done within a week, I'm sure these cards will still be around 60 k And that's 60000 uh, stubs. Uh, you can just buy the card back in another week, you know, after you get it. Uh, you can buy it for like 30,000. So you can make like 30,000 stubs off this program. Super, super easy. All right. My tips for getting XP. Uh, I just posted an XP video. That was the last video I did. Uh, go check it out if you want some XP tips. All right. Next thing I want to talk about, which is something that I have been doing a little bit here, is if you actually go to your inventory. All right. So just go to collect, go to my inventory, and then go to like uh, my stadiums. Okay. Quick sell your duplicate stadiums. I still have some duplicates I need to sell. But, uh, you know, some of, the, some of you guys might have four or five of each stadium you can just sell. Uh, just sell your duplicates. So, what I would do to make the most amount of stubs possible is go into collections, go into stadiums, go to MLB, and just collect as many stadiums as you can. Alright, just go to auto select, collect whatever stadiums you have, and then the leftover stadiums, alright, go to my inventory, go to, uh, that's, that's sponsorships, go to my stadiums, and just qu start quick selling the duplicates. In case you guys don't know how to do that, you um, you click on the stadium, quick sell options, and then just press quick sell duplicates. All right, that's all you have to do, and you can make a couple hundred stubs from that. And it, it literally it could take you three minutes to do. So it's something I recommend all you guys do. Uh, another thing you might want to do is go through your equipment and perks, because uh, you know I I think I have some perks in here I could quick sell actually. I didn't even. I uh, didn't even check. I know I have some gold ones. Some of the gold ones go for like 700. All right, we're going to see how much this one goes for. Uh, like that, that's 550 coins, or coins, this isn't Madden. 550 stubs right there. Super, super easy. All right, so some of these things can take you like three minutes to do, and you can make a couple hundred stubs from this. So highly recommend you guys do this. It's super simple. Takes no time at all. All right, you can do the exact same thing with your equipment. All right, so if you want to go through your bats, uh, how much does this go for? Let me see. Okay, can't sell for anything right now. But, uh, you know, some of the golds might go for a decent amount. How much do the golds go for? All right, only 100. That's still 100. That's 100 for doing basically nothing. So I recommend you guys do this because it takes literally no time. All right? Another way you guys can make stubs, and this is something I talked about in the last video, is showdown. You need to do your showdown, man. Do the showdowns. Start knocking out those team affinities. I'm almost done with the uh, NL, as you can see right here. I still have the NL West to do. And, you know, a little bit of the NL Central to do. But other than that, this should not take me that long to finish. All right. Showdown is not that difficult compared to last year. Only tip I can give you is to just draft draft guys with power. All right. You don't want to pick pick a team with, uh, you know, just contact players. Or you don't want to just pick your favorite player. The best cards in, this, in, that, uh, in the showdown are Jordan Alvarez, Joey Gallo, 
Giancarlo Stanton, those guys, because those guys rake. They have a lot of power. All right, so just draft guys of power, and that's really the only tip I can give you. In the showdowns, you just want you just want base runners. You don't have to hit a home run every time. You just want base runners in the showdowns. All right, that's how you can complete them very very easily. Okay, and that's really all I have for you guys today. Something you guys can do as well, just on the side, is you can flip the market right now. Uh, the market is the market is strange. I'm just gonna be honest. the market is in a strange place right now. There are there are commons that are going for 2,500 stubs. I'll give you an example right here. If we go to collections, um, I'm trying to co I can't complete the Cubs right now. I literally cannot complete the Cubs collection because this guy is not available on the on the market. And there's 700 people that have a buy order in for 2,500 stubs. I don't know what what to do about this. I've already put one in. It's just not selling to me. This it's it's really frustrating. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. I just have to wait for someone to sell it to me. Um, that's something that should probably be fixed, though. You know, 57 overall should not be going for 2,500 stubs. That's my opinion. I'm sure you guys would agree with me. Uh, and there's, there's cards like that all over the place that are expensive. It's just because they're adding new players into the game with the roster changes and stuff. Either way, it's frustrating. You know, it's kind of annoying. But, like I said, it is what it is. So, if you want to make some stubs here and there, maybe just go through your collections to see if you have any commons that sell for a decent amount of stubs. Even some of the bronzes go for a decent amount, like this uh, Trevor, Trevor McGill right here. Uh, 2,500 as well. But I actually got him, so I got I got a little bit lucky. So, something you guys might want to keep in mind, just go through your collections, maybe see if you can sell any cards for a decent amount, and uh, that could be a way to make some really, really easy stubs. All right, because the market is, like I said, is in a strange place. All right, uh, so that's really all I have for you guys today. I gotta talk about the channel for a second. Talked about this a million times. I just haven't been posting lately. Because I've been insanely busy, been gone every week. I've had games pretty much every day of the week. And I don't get home until late. So I can't make a video at 10 o'clock and then expect to be up at 6 o'clock in the morning. And I still have homework, I still have to eat, shower, all that stuff. So it's just, life has been busy. Alright, it's that simple. Alright, I'm still going to try to post as much as I can. I'm going to try to record a couple of videos this weekend to sprinkle through the week. Hope I have the time. Alright, that's that's all it's going to come down to. If I had the time, I'll make videos. If I don't, I just simply can't. Alright, but over the summer... Uh, you'll be seeing a lot of videos from me. We're going to grind this summer out hard. All right, heading into Madden 22, if that's what it's going to be called. Um, looking forward to it, man. So, hope you guys did enjoy. I'm going to do my shouts today right now. In case you guys do not know, I do shouts in every single video. All you have to do to get shouted out is comment on this video. I'll shout you out in the next video. All right, so it's super, super simple. Just comment. All right, comment anything you want, and uh, I'll shout you out. Okay, so here we go. Uh, comments on the last video. We got Luke Bucket. Uh, Goose 1334, Ty Dye, Algen Tunser, that's an OG right there, uh, KB Sliders, Twizzy, that's another OG right there, uh, Hunt Awakens, uh, another OG, George Washington, In York Face, both of you guys OGs right there. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below, and I'll talk to you all later. Stay safe for me, and peace out.